uh, access road for canal maintenance. In actual fact, when they started building, I came and pointed out where the building should start from, the pillar, the survey pillar. The next day before I came, they removed the pillar for me not to have any point of evidence again. So this very house has blocked the chance of maintaining the canal. Activities of the encroachers on the mountains surrounding the project have far-reaching implications. Once they are laid bare in this manner, siltation of the irrigation canals easily takes place with the slightest rains. These heaps of sand attest to this. These built-up areas have blown away any traces of the beginnings of the wager irrigation scheme. This used to be the location of the demonstration and seed multiplication farms for the project. They are aware they are building on beds in an irrigated environment with hydrants staring them in the face, and they just cannot be bothered. Various questions arise. Are they emboldened? because they are sure they bought the land from an authentic source? Are they oblivious to the fact that by denying farmers the use of the land, they are contributing to food insecurity in the country? Or could they have bought the land without the knowledge of the chiefs? Some have suggested that the land was sold without the knowledge of the chiefs. It is not a matter of individuals selling the land without the knowledge of the chiefs. Uh, we are much aware of it but the problem started let me say with the government from uh, we carve an entire acreage for them area for them a huge area they dispose part of the land called iron city for individuals they give it on lease and for housing purposes uh, iron city we call that, that place iron city it is part of the wager irrigation then the government disposed that area for uh, uh, residential purposes which wasn't the intention for the acquisition all that area was meant for farming. So when the government started releasing those areas for farming purposes, uh, for residential purposes, then the way the chiefs also saw that, then we can also give it out. We can also, it is there that we also came in. That we also started giving it out. So it is not about individuals, not about land gas who dispose these areas. I can confidently tell you that the chiefs are aware of the disposition. After they had disposed of the land in this manner, the encroachment went into full swing. These beds on which buildings are springing up were cropped only last season, rendering the farmers jobless. Now impoverished, 